Hello everyone, welcome back to another video of Thunder Slogan here, and in this video we're going to be reviewing the Jailbreak 2022 May update. So, as I usually do, let's go ahead and read the Jailbreak description, everything that has to do with this update. Another update for you, out now. Fast travel jets, book a private flight to quickly travel around the map. New bank and new bank vault upper management. New Crater City Stores, Lemurian Store, Garage and Gun Store, Damage Direction Indicators, plus many other changes and improvements, use code Private Jet for 10,000 cash, enjoy. Okay, so, uh, you know, I'll, I'll take a different vehicle of it, hold on. Okay, so the first thing that we're gonna go ahead and review, I'm just gonna go in order here, we're gonna go ahead and review with the fast travel jets or private jets, I don't know, whatever you wanna call them. So you find these jets at the airport right over here and the Crater City Airport. You can find them at both airports, so I think, not too sure, but uh, I think you can only find one, like at a time, like it can only, like you can only find, like, there's only one of them, I think, and like, you know, they can only be at one airport, I think, but they do go to both airports. You know, I'm gonna... I'm actually gonna go check and see if there is a jet at the other airport as well. Hold on. Oh wait, there's another. There's 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 another jet right here. Okay, I uh. Wait a minute, who's taking? Wait, who's taking that jet then? Uh, okay, maybe you just. Okay, maybe you just like launch it and then like. Okay, I'm a little confused, but it seems like that you can find a jet at both of the airports at the same time. So. You know, just so that's clarified. Goat's plane. <laughs> yeah, I know, right? Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and see how this works. I mean, I mean, I already like reviewed like a lot of the stuff I like on my stream that I streamed yesterday. But for the video, I'm gonna go ahead and review everything. Also, like I'm doing right now. So you can launch the jet for 5,000 cash applied cross map, you know, to the other airport, so we're gonna go ahead and do this right now. And I will have you know that this jet is very fast, like probably faster than the Bugatti Veyron's top speed, as you can see. Oh, there's another jet right there, okay then. Oh, a jet... It just left, okay then. So, the jet that was here left because this jet came here, okay, I guess... I guess that makes sense, well, him not really, but... Alright, let's, uh, let's go back to Crater City. And that jet also left. Okay, so yeah, that's pretty much how the, the private jet works. Uh, you know, you need to pay five thousand for each time, so just, you know, keep that in mind. That, you know, so you don't go broke or anything. But yeah, that can be a pretty good getaway for criminals. Like you know, be trying to like you know get away from a cop or something. Want to go there side of the map? That'll be that'd be a pretty good getaway. So. You know, definitely keep in mind that you can use those jets, you know, for 5,000 cash at least. Okay, so next up here, you know, I'm going in order. We're gonna go ahead and check out the new bank and the new and the new bank vault. So, yeah, we have a much different bank lobby here. This is now here. There's like two doors you can enter through in here. The bank truck is now, I mean, it's still here, but it's, you know, the area here looks quite a bit different. <laughs> and then right here is the back door, as you can see, and you just walk over here, right in here. Oh, the, wait a minute. Okay, yeah, I would think you need a, I would think you need a key card to open this door right here. Uh, what can I, oh, yes, I can. Yep, okay, it's, that's, what I figured. <laughs> okay, so we have the new vault. Okay, yep, we do have the new vault, so that's pretty cool we got on the first try. 
So let's go up here. So there's some ways is on the steps, not too bad. And then uh, you ever check that out in a minute. Then I, I, I guess he can't walk through there. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. You <laughs> don't don't walk through there unless you want to get killed. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and open the vault here. Those are waves of steam, assuming. Yep, I am correct. Okay, the vault is open. Let's go ahead and go inside. And as you can see, we get 4,000 cash from this specific bank vault cell. I, I mean, seeing like, you know, this vault isn't really like difficult to like, you know, get to. I mean, I could see that making sense. Okay, I hear that you, uh, okay, I'll, 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 I'll keep collecting my money, I'll, uh, I'll go over there as soon as my money is done collecting. Okay, got 4,000 cash, let's go ahead, let's go through, yeah, right here, through the dynamite door, whatever you want to call it, so. Oh, this is, like, pretty easy, okay, uh, let's just climb right up here, looks like, looks like we just have to do that. Oh, okay, wait a minute. Okay, this might be a bit more complicated than I thought. Okay, what do we have to do now? Uh... Oh, wait a minute. <laughs> what is this? Uh, okay, you have to... Oh, this is interesting. You have to, like... You have to go out through the roof? Okay, that's... I, okay, I've never seen that before. Okay, I guess that's what... Oh, that's why the asteroid hit up there, because, uh... They destroyed the, the roof and then they made a new one where you can escape from. Okay, did I get your reasons now, but do you know? Okay, so yeah, that is the new bank ball. I think, uh, you know, I reviewed that enough. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the three new buildings that are in Crater City now. Now, something else to keep in mind. Uh, they did say that they put the $1 million dealership in Crater City and it's no longer here in the town like it is just like it was a place of this like a building that has like that serves like no purpose now basically <laughs> now i'm assuming the reason for that is to well you know give crater city you know making it more useful giving it more of a use because like before like you wouldn't really like come over here much except for like the casino and the jetpack but now it has you know more uses so i I, I can, you know, I can see that being a reason. So right over here we have the one million dollar dealership. As you can see, all the one million dollar cars are right here. The, the monster truck is here, and the uh, drone is here. And the trailblazer and the bull bike, the, they're all here. <laughs> I just, I don't know, for some reason I just wanted to put my customization on all of them because I don't know why not. Okay, so then, yep, okay, it's right there. The gun store is right here, so ideally you want to enter through this store here, then go right over here, then you can, you know, get the, the weapons loadout thing right here, then over here there isn't, yeah, there isn't very much over here, it's just extra to the building, I guess, but I mean, there is another door here, so. Like I said, ideally you want to go through this store, then go over here, then, you know, get all the weapons that you want. Then, down this way, I believe, uh, okay, where is it, where is it, I think it's, no, okay, it's not right there either, okay, it's right here. Right here is another garage I can go right into, then customize your vehicle, that is if you don't have, you know, the premium garage game pass. If you do, then you can just customize the vehicle anywhere, but if you don't have the premium garage game pass, then you can... This is another location you can now go at in Crater City, you know, giving them more usefulness, I guess. I don't know, I don't even know if that's a word or not. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna go ahead and test out is the damage indicator. So, if you can go ahead and just get a bunch of weapons, or I don't know if you have them ready, just... I would get like a sniper, pistol, machine gun, you know, those kind of weapons. Wait, I want to see something. Hold on, put your gun away. Try punching me, see if that, like, works. Okay, nope, it doesn't. It doesn't, okay. Okay, so, go ahead and shoot me. I'm gonna be facing forward. Then, wait, no, 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 not the pistol, not the pistol. Hold on, hold on. Use, like, use, like, a machine gun for it so it doesn't damage him too much. Okay, 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 you're... <laughs> oh my god, okay, this... This only shoot, like, one time, like, jeez, okay. Oh my god, you must... 
necessarily want to take out the criminals, I see. Okay, let's try again. So this shoot me like one time. Be facing forward. Okay, so as you can see, damaging care got shot from forward then left. Go ahead. As you can see, got shot from left and then facing behind. Go ahead. See it shows you where you got shot from behind and right. So yeah, yeah, and if you move the camera, it also like will show you. So yeah, that's pretty much how that works. So let's also try go to like some like crazy distance and try like shooting you with the sniper. Maybe like on top of like a tallest building, crazy city, and shoot me from like all the way like down here. Maybe and yeah, no, I don't know. Wait, this whole time he didn't have the sniper. Out. Uh, well, I mean, okay, then I'll just let you buy it. Okay, so he got the sniper now, so, you know, that's good. You know, now we can actually test this out, so... I'm gonna be facing this any kind of, like, weird direction. How about, like, how about, like, I don't know, like, like this, I guess, so... Let's go ahead and shoot me with that sniper whenever you're ready. Ooh, okay, yeah, so I took a lot of damage from that, and it did show me where I got shot from, so, you know, that's... That's good, that's good, so no matter what distance you get shot from, then it's gonna damage in a cave, it's gonna tell you where you got shot from. Okay, so Bedemo did mention the description that they came out with the new code, so yeah, they do actually have an ATM machine, a casino if you didn't know, right here, and they also, you also have to press E to open the ATM now, instead of like, you know, just walking up to it, so I mean, I, I personally like that better, so you know, you don't get this you lying in the way, just randomly, you know? So if you go to an ATM and you enter the code private jet, and then you click redeem, you will get 10,000 jailbreak cash, but it doesn't work for me now because I already redeemed it, which I did on yesterday's stream. So it's not gonna work for me now, but if you have not redeemed that code yet on an ATM machine, on one of these things, I mean, there's like one in the bank, one in the casino, like one by a train station, one in the gas station, I believe, then you will get 10,000 free chairway cash. So yeah, I would, I would definitely go redeem that if you haven't. I also forgot to show that there is a Black Hawk up here on top of the one million dollar dealership, and there is, you know, a ladder to get up here with it, so. I know I didn't really go over that, so let's, uh, you know, point that out there. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and do the outro on the casino's roof because, well, why not? But anyway, that is pretty much everything that has to do with this update, so... You're probably wondering what my opinion on this update is, and uh, I need to think about this, hold on. So after some thinking, I'm going to go ahead and give this update a 6.5 out of 10, and you're probably wondering my reasons for that. Well, I do really like the, you know, the travel jets, I do like a new bank ball, I do like... You know, how there's a garage and gun store in Crater City now, I do like the damage direction and indicators. But, I guess like the only thing that I don't like is how they removed the one million dollar dealership from the town, you know. Removing you know, quite a bit of nostalgia because it's been there for, you know, like four years now. And you have to travel a lot more to get to the one million dollar dealership, which, uh... You know, you probably think you could just spawn the cars, but you can't spawn the drone in Black Hawk, so you have to travel, you know, a much longer distance to get to those now. But I mean, other than that, I like everything else about this update, which is why my 6.5 rating now 10 still stands. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video, so if you did find this video helpful and entertaining, be sure to hit the like button. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you have not already to see it first time. See me, that really helped me out and it's greatly appreciated and you can always change your mind later. And be sure to turn on notifications so that way you don't miss out on any new content here on the channel. But yeah, that is going to be it, and I will see you all in the next video.